First of all, I want to thank God for allowing me to do this video today. And uh, secondly, welcome to Box and Taste uh, LNG. Today, I want to talk to you guys about the uh, Floyd Mayweather Marquez fight. Finally, yeah, I'm on it. Um, the what the real talk is about this fight is um, you know I'm running across cats who saying um, you know Mayweather ain't you know he ain't got it no more you know he, he been off for two years Marquez gonna whoop him you know um, the last time I seen Floyd Mayweather in an interview. Um, he was saying that he hasn't brought his A game to the table yet. I mean, against fighters where you guys think, oh man, he, he that was his A game. He said that against Hatton, that was his C game. I mean, you mean to tell me that was your C game? Not your B game, but your C game against Haddon and you knocked him out I mean well then that means if you bring your A game it's gotta be devastating I mean it's, it's gotta be you know you know it's gotta be on some crazy level you know um and I think that um you know another guy that besides David Hay that these guys, that people are underestimating this Floyd Mayweather. They, uh, you know, they, they, they're bidding against him, bro. People, ladies, gentlemen, they, 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 uh, they bidding against this guy, you know, on this Marquez fight. You know, they giving Marquez the, you know, the ups, you know. And, um, I'm going to tell you something. Floyd Mayweather has never, in my eyes, had a boring fight as Marquez and Casa Mayor. That was a boring fight. I seen them in a press conference. They were fighting and pushing each other, talking bad about each other, acting like it was just going to be a spectacular fight. You get in, the fight comes, and you didn't get no action until the 12th round. And I'm like, it's the 12th round. The fight is over. The twelfth round, the last ten seconds, all of a sudden they start brawling. You like, what happened to the, to all the, big talk and all this kind of stuff? Even in Floyd Mayweather De La Hoya, Floyd Mayweather came on, in the round. He you saw action because De La Hoya wouldn't let it not be. You saw action because Floyd Mayweather wouldn't let him hit him. You saw action when Floyd Mayweather start connecting and making De La Hoya disoriented. I mean, he didn't know what the heck was going on when, when, when Floyd Mayweather started connecting on him. I mean, it was something else. I think uh, one time you may have seen Floyd Mayweather's B game was uh, against, uh, or maybe his A, um, Arturo Gatti. I mean, imagine if that Floyd Mayweather comes in against Marquez. I mean, come on, man. Come on, man. Come on, man. But uh, I had to make that, you know. I mean, you know, people talking down on Floyd and all this here. So I just want to set the record straight, man. It's, uh, my opinion, I I, um, I hope Floyd wins. That's my thing. This is real talk. Um, I hope David Hay wins. My thing, real talk. Um, and um, another thing I was going to get on to is um you know david hay has um you know he's able to uh to weave punches and um you know him being able to weave punches like he does uh he he don't need to pull up his left hand as long as he keep weaving like and continue weaving as a matter of fact i think he's gotten better the guy, you know, you're talking about a guy who's constantly improving versus diminishing, you know. Um, 
David Hay is a, you know, you know, a, a, a fine uh, piece of uh, equipment when it comes down to his ring, and uh, Floyd Mayweather is uh, needless to say, and um, you know, I don't know. Again, I'm gonna put it out there again. Maybe you guys, some of you guys are racist, man. I mean, that's why you keep, you know, putting this uh, negative feedback on David Hay and uh, Floyd Mayweather, you know? But, um, it, I mean, it really don't matter, though. Um, really, when it comes down to it, you know, I think uh, David Hay is definitely going to have to knock Klitschko out. There is no question about it. Um, because if you watch the fight, especially in these really foreign countries and stuff, and even in America, they do it, they do a lot of cheating for the, the people that they want to stay on top. And I don't know if they pay the refs or they do something, give them perks, because in the Andre, uh, versus, uh, Butte fight, um, Butte obviously whooped Andre. I mean... They say throughout the fight, in which I did watch some of it. I think I watched the whole thing. But anyway, when it got to the part where um, Butte had knocked Andre out, the ref counted for 30 seconds. I mean, obviously cheating, you know, and it's not a secret. I mean, you know, this is an evil world. People do dirty things all the time, you know, so why do you expect boxing to be any different? They're... They're, of course they're going to cheat of course they're going to do devious stuff dirty tricks and plaster of Paris uh, and uh, um, I mean putting stuff in people's eyes so, so they can blind them doing a the fight I mean come on man they just, this is how this world is it's the evil world um, ran by Satan so um, but he's not powerful in God but um the, the thing is, is that it happens all the time. So, um, it's, 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 I mean, it's, it's just how it is. But, uh, David Hayes definitely going to have to knock him out because I think if they cheated with, uh, uh, Andre versus Butte, they'll cheat with David Hay versus Klitschko. And, um, you know, David Hay got to know that he's black, too. That's going to make it even worse because they sure don't want, as much as they don't want a, a Butte, which is a, a Latino or Mexican um, fighter to beat Andre, who's not, you know, they surely are not going to want a black man to beat um, a Russian champion. I mean, you know, they, they're surely not going to want a black man to beat, really don't want a black man to beat any kind of champion, to be a champion, period. But the fact that they don't want him to, um, you know, I mean, it's got to be that much more worse. I mean, so, um, I mean, and if you don't believe me, look at the stuff that he had. He had to fight them three times. One fighter has to fight two brothers three times because the brothers are too scared that they would possibly lose against this guy. And he'll just disappear in the wind and not fight him again. That they sign a contract where they mostly and that they sign a contract where he has to fight them three times just in case. Oh, just in, just in case you beat us, we're gonna fight you three times. Oh man, please. Yeah, y'all can say whatever y'all want to about Klitschko now. They suck. I said it. Uh, they they fight over the hill guys just like David Hay says. Um, one of the Klitschkos. Um, um got whooped by um, Lennox Lewis, um, and on top of that, the other Klitschko don't have a chin, and so, you know, and, you know, all, all the other Klitschko like to do with Tally is wrestle you in the ring, anyway, man, straight like that, the bottom line is, uh, dang it, David Hayes is going to have to uh, knock out uh, Klitschko, and uh, my next video, I'll talk more about uh, Floyd Mayweather and um, Marquez and, uh, because I want to um, get that squared away. Um, I'll tell you my picks and we'll be straight to it. Uh, box of taste of G. You know what it is.